I don't even like this recording. Guys, I'm kinda nervous. It's been a while since I did this. It's really sitting down this time. I haven't oh, sat down. I feel like we're doing an interview. I'm kinda nervous. My leave out. My, my face is so lean. I just realized how lean my face is. All right. Hey, bunnies. Welcome to another Naked Sunday video. Before we begin, go ahead and grab yourself a drink. What I'm drinking is H2O. Now, this is kind of different from my other Naked Sunday videos. Usually, I have. I can't even speak anymore. Hmm. Usually, usually, let me slow down and just be. Just, just be calm. Usually, I have a cocktail in my hand, some rum runner, something of the sort, telling you to go ahead and grab yours and whatever. But for the nature of this video, we are talking about or vagina. What better than H2O? Or if you have some 100% uh, cranberry juice, that works as well. All right. So to kick off this video based on this topic, you will see that we are talking about my vagina routine, my vagina maintenance routine. I do believe I've already done a video like this. I think, I don't know, I don't know, but we're going to do it anyways. And my first thing is you need to drink water. If you drink alcohol as much as I do, then you definitely need to make sure that you are staying hydrated throughout the day. This is good for your skin, it's good for your hair, it's good for your nails, it's good for your vagina. If you're wondering why you might be a little tart, down there you're not drinking enough water if your urine is like a really dark golden brownish color you need more water if your urine is completely clear then you're drinking too much water but i'm not a professional so go talk to your doctor about that as well maybe right right but google said it so it has to be true okay i try to do at least eight cups a day um that's the minimum intake for you know adults body so i try to do that this is my second bottle which is very bad so i need to finish this and go on to another round because i'm probably going to have a drink later on tonight anyways moving forward so that's the first thing make sure that you stay hydrated lots of water you can do like a cup of cranberry juice you feel me good that's what we're putting inside of our body of course if you take probiotics that's even best all those cranberry pills amazing i do neither which is probably not that great and i should probably start yeah we're talking about vagina maintenance today i'm rambling all right so my vag vagina <laughs> my vagina maintenance is pretty simple i think daily every single day 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 i use my fresh box daily moisturizing cleanser this literally keeps my girl my hoo-ha my vajayjay my vagina nice and supple and moist all throughout the night all throughout the day she cleans without leaving any residue any dryness she doesn't dry you at all it's literally a moisturizing cleanser i did do a review on this and i do have a coupon code for this it's fresh kissy 454 you can get i think it's 20 percent off or is it 15 percent? you get some money off of your purchase once it's 20 dollars or more you get a little change off of it and this one i believe is her newer formula i found that i don't have to shake her up to get my you know thick creamy consistency i love doing this <laughs> she's very much so like a lotion so imagine imagine putting lotion on your vagina right it's very very much oil based it it does have a smell but like i said it smells like natural herbs if you don't like the herby smell then you're definitely going to like the next product i'm going to show you i'm just pretty much moisturizing my hands as you can see it does the job moisturize my little tat moisturize my dry elbows look at that look at that shine all right now we got a fresh box and some fresh arms but that is what i do daily my fresh box is a part of my um whatchamacallit daily vagina maintenance all right now weekly what i do i i don't mind here down there but after a while it becomes all right Lori, come on now you're doing a little bit too much if you choose to grow your hair out 
kudos to you. I once I went a whole month, and I think I said this like years ago, I went a whole month without sharing, nearing, waxing, anything. And I felt so free. The only thing is the hairs, it traps sweat, it traps um, discharge. Why can't I think today? It traps discharge and then you know that creates odor. Especially if you're using um, pads or pantsy liners that have like scents to it, those two scents combined, no bueno. I always recommend 100% cotton pantsy liners and pads. That's all I use if I'm not wearing my diva cup on my period i'm wearing cotton pads or cotton tampons i don't really like tampons either i don't like pads either after my cup anyways that's beyond the point um when i'm ovulating obviously it's going to be discharged i wear my 100 percent cotton panty liners so yeah i was talking about weekly oh my gosh i'm rambling i'm so sorry you guys so <laughs> weekly i do my hair removal i haven't gotten a professional wax as yet but when I do go and get that done, of course, you know, I'll take you along with me for the ride so we can experience it together. But I have waxed before at home. Ugh, not a fan. So what I do is I nair. And because I have fatter, have a fatter labia, like my vagina lips are, you know, um, I have to shave in between because I don't want to put hair in between my lips. You feel me? Now, the nair that I use is, the, the one that I love, 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 is this one, the baby oil one. This one, $7.99 at my local beauty supply store. Um, or if I can't get the baby oil one, I get the cocoa butter one. The baby oil one leaves it so smooth and supple and just, oh, so nice. Um, the cocoa butter one is good too. It doesn't dry it out, doesn't, you know, any of that. It's just regular. Now, if you worry that the cream is going to seep in and touch your clitoris and burn you because that's really where the burning sensation happens and then you don't want to leave this on for more than 10 minutes set a timer do it right before you get into the shower right put it on be on your phone instagram facebook whatever the case is watch the time as soon as it hits nine minutes you can start turning on your shower getting the water hot jump in and then i have a bladeless hair remover Ugh. I left it in the bathroom. I'll see if I can find a picture and put it somewhere here for you to see. I use that and I just scrape away the hair remover product. Now, as I was saying, if you're worried that the cream will get between your lips and burn your clits, what you can use is some coconut oil. Put a little bit of coconut oil between your lips and that will prevent the cream from burning your hoo-ha. All right, but again, try not to get the cream anywhere in it. Okay, okay, all right. Now, for the shaving portion of the evening, like I said, I don't want the cream to go in between my lips, but at the same time, I don't want there to be hair there. So what do we do about the hair there? We shave it. And what I use is my Gillette Satin Care Ultra Sensitive. This, I try to get anything that is for sensitive skin, even if my skin is not sensitive, which it is to an extent. I try to get anything that says this skin because I know that it won't be as harsh on my skin. Even if they're lying to me and it's all in my head, I'm fine with that. All right. So I do this and then I take a sensitive skin disposable razor blade and I use a new one every time. So I get like this big pack with like, what is in there? 15 is in this one, right? So that's 15 weeks worth of shaving right there. So that's a lot. And I pay like, what, $3 for this whole bag? This right here, it get, comes with two blades and a, a little strip on the top right here. And in comparison to the other razor blades, other razor blades are way too sharp. Way, 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 way too sharp. And that will cut you, that, that's how you get razor bumps, that's how you get nicks, that's how you, you can, one false move but you lose a clit. So, yeah. I like this one because it's not harsh. It's not, you know, irritating or anything like that. Now, when I'm done, that's when I take my loofah and I scrub, 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 and I exfoliate and all that stuff. I go in then with my Fresh Box Daily Moisturizing Cleanser. See if we can get her to focus. There we go. There we go. Fresh Box Daily Moisturizing Cleanser. Again, I do have a coupon code, which is FreshKissy454, and that will give you some dollars off. Use that cleanse down there. Now, her newest product, which I've now used twice because I got it 
at an event that I was hosting, the Amiga's Garden Essentials Fish Fry. <laughs> and this is her exfoliating yoni sugar scrub. That is the packaging there, which again, you know, you can use it. You can use my, cu my coupon code towards it. It smells so good. Like, 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 like brown sugar. Like, you see that? Cameraman, pick it up. Pick it up before it finish. Ah! <laughs> yes. So this is what I use and I exfoliate my yoni with that. And it makes it smell so good. Again, your vagina is not supposed to smell like flowers. It's not supposed to smell like fruit. It's not supposed to smell like anything like that. But what I do, because I have long nails, I'll take my thumbnail, <laughs> thumbnail, get it? And just scoop it out like that. Put it in my, put it on my palm. Cause I get, and then this, I don't get in between my lips. This is just on the surface. And I just take it and I just rub and it exfoliates and you can feel the little sugar BBs doing its job. It's nice and sticky. It literally feels like honey and brown sugar mixed together. And I, I, I think I've mentioned this years and years and years ago. That's what I use to exfoliate my lips, brown sugar and honey. I haven't done it in a minute. Okay. To be honest, the, the lip exfoliating thing, but this is exactly like that. There you can see the, the brown sugar curdles roll up. Can you see? You can't really see because I have the fresh box on my hand, but you see how glowy my palms look? That's the fresh box with the exfoliating um, sugar scrub. This is eight ounces, so you know this is going to last you a while, okay? This will last you a good, 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 good while. So when your man go down there, it's nice and yummy. Or your girl, whoever, <laughs> I'm not judging, honey. Anyways, so after I do all of that, I go back in with my coconut oil to moisturize even more. I'm done nearing, I'm done shaving, I'm done cleansing with my feminine wash, I'm done exfoliating with my sugar scrub. I'm now drying off, passing dry with my cotton towel. <laughs> and then I, yeah, jump in with the coconut oil as a moisturizer. Just like if when you finish bathing, you put on lotion or you put on oils or whatever. Let me fix my hair really quick. I feel like I'm not you know, representing properly. So yeah, I go in with my coconut oil and I again put that just on the surface top part, the labia majora, I hope I'm saying that right. And that's where I moisturize with that. And that's it. I go about my day and I don't get razor bumps because I'm not shaving the, the, the full surface area. I found that because up to maybe even last month, I was still shaving the whole thing and I realized if I just take the extra couple minutes to properly remove the hair just one time for the week because when you shave it grows back like wildfire like it grows back so quick right so when I take the time to just nair it remove it completely and then just you know shave the little areas that really don't grow as fast Honey, honey. And if your man has a problem with prickly hairs, he needs to grow up, okay? Hair grows, hair grows. It, it's, that's what it's supposed to do, all right? All right, and that is my vagina maintenance video. And if you didn't hear it the last two, three, four, five, six, seven times I mentioned it, you can use my coupon code FRESHKISSY 454 <laughs> to get a percentage off some money off of your fresh box purchase of $20 or more. All right, so I'll leave that coupon code in the description. I'll flash it all over the screen so you can see it. My hands are very sticky right now, so I'm going to wash them, but look how glowy they are. Ooh, yeah, I hope I didn't leave anything else. I don't think I left anything else, but that is my vagina maintenance video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Until next time. I'm not even going to promise you another video next week because Jano. <laughs> Peace sign and kissy face. Bye.